How's it, Aloha gang, and welcome back. We are here live on the island of Maui at the Hyatt Regency Maui Resort and Spa. And throughout the day today, we've been celebrating Ho'okipa Hawaii, this initiative from the Hawaii Hotel Alliance. We want to bring in the spokesperson right now, Kekoa McClellan, to talk a little bit more about just some of the stories we had a chance to hear today. Kekoa and Connor, yeah. Incredible stories from, from chef to Kekoa and Connor. The spirit of Ho'okipa Hawaii is clearly here at the Hyatt Regency Kaanapali. Now, uh, Kikoa, let's talk a little bit about some of the opportunities. When you, uh, A lot of these stories we heard today were uh, about what drew them into hospitality, also from where they started to how they've had the opportunity to navigate a lot of different uh, careers. You know, one of the common themes is how we all have a pilina to our hotels. You know, for me, it was cakey time at the Keaho Beach Resort with Orohana on the Big Island or, or my wedding with my wife over in, in, in Waikiki. And I think the best part about Ho'okipa Hawaii is that for us as Kama Aina or people who just live in and around these beautiful islands of ours, we all have a connection to one of these spaces. So we just show up, you know, find, find an opportunity to come down to one of these properties, make friends. And if you're interested, it, hotel wages are 26% higher post-pandemic than they were. I mean, there are incredible opportunities at every property across our state. Check them out. Absolutely. Thank you so much, Kiko. We're going to navigate inside right now uh, to meet Trixie Nueska Gaynor, who is actually uh, the director of stewarding over here at the property. Uh, and Trixie, we were talking a little bit earlier today uh, about just hospitality and the career paths. Uh, what drew you into the Hyatt and uh, pursuing a career in hospitality? So originally, the wages. I started off at a very young age here at the Hyatt Regency Maui, and I grew my career and I saw my salary increase as well. So obviously I had to make the best decision for me and my family. Uh, Trixie, what are some of the different roles and different uh, things you've been able to do with uh, being a part of this industry? So I started off as a fitness associate in the spa. I moved on to recreation. I've been the assistant executive housekeeper, the executive housekeeper, director of housekeeping, um, commercial cleaning, and now I'm the director of stewarding. So. We were talking a little bit earlier as well. Uh, we met Connor and Kekoa, the father-son duo. We, we met Chef uh, Gavin Utrillo earlier as well. But with all of you folks, I, I would imagine longtime friendships that you've made throughout being a part of this industry, spe uh, specifically here at this property. Oh, absolutely. It's not really friendship. It's more like they're big brothers that I never wanted. It's, it's that family. Um, everyone here is connected. And it's, you know, you grow up and you've always been pounded into you. You never forget where you come from. And that's what Hyatt is. You never forget where you come from because people make you remember. And that's why I've been here so long. Uh, Trixie, what do you enjoy most uh, about your career when you look back at all the different things you've been able to do? Uh, what, what has been the most rewarding part of this whole career in hospitality? The people. The people. It's not just the team you work with, but the visitors, right? Um, Kamainas that come through, you all become one big family. And that's the most important thing to any local, this family. Uh, Trixie, we're talking with Kiko a little bit earlier today uh, just about the different opportunities, the different things that um, people can pursue uh, and if they have a goal. Um, I know that Hyatt has really supported people with their mission to, to continue to move up, but what, uh, what would you say to anybody out there who's considering a career in hospitality? If they are considering um, a career in hospitality, come work for the Hyatt Regency Maui. Um, and I say that because that's how my career grew. Um, it's, you have a goal and they support your goal. And that's what I love about it. Absolutely. Okay, mahalo nui for the time, Trixie. And again, throughout uh, the day, we had an opportunity to speak about opportunities uh, with Ho'okipa Hawaii, Hawaiian hospitality here at home. That's going to do it for us here in Maui. We're going to head to break. You're watching High Now Daily. We'll be right back.